Oh, cheers to Stu for those races there. They're not market raising now then for the summer hurdle. Um, it's a two mile, one foot on a listed handicap. And I've got Snaggle Tooth at the top for Joshua Sutherland, Duke of Finsbury, Paul Rhodes, Mandrake, Root Martin, Lidham, Fire Inferno, Paul Rhodes, Cold Point, Darren Thompson, Alien Assassin, Graham Clutterbuck, Magellan for Kevin Minahan, and Expensive Nala for Thomas Rogers. So just eight this time, and away they go. Two greys, and get their way towards the first of the ten flights of furlough that they've got to negotiate in this one. With the horse being driven up around the outside there, called point. I like it was interested in the lead. They're going like sprinters or milers at the moment as they race towards the first. They're not hanging about at all. An expensive Nala was the first one over the first flight. They're already at the second. And they're all safely over that one as well. With an expensive Nala. Settled down into the lead then by four lengths or so. Duke of Finsbury, the grey on the outside, is second. Fire Inferno Stable Mate is third. Down on this near rail, Snaggle Tooth in the black and the red. And Cool Point Mandrake Root also in that line. Oh, there was a mistake there by Alien Assassin, who's the second of the greys. And that one's now dropped into the backpack with Magellan. And the aforementioned Cool Point has also dropped back a little bit. So expensive Nile then is the clear leader. From Duke of Finsbury and Mandrake Root, second and third, then Fire Inferno and Snaggletooth with Alien Assassin just tucked in behind them and a bit of a gap to Magellan and Cool Point at the back. So they're quite well strung out. The pace has been pretty hot and it's expensive Nala. It was a good four or five clear of Mandrake Root has now gone into second. Then Duke of Finsbury is third. Snaggletooth is fourth as they get over the fourth. And they're all safely over that one. The expensive Nala. The clear leader, Duke of Finsbury, is second. Mandrake Root, who's predominantly a chaser these days on the inside, dropped that one really nicely, though. Then comes Snaggletooth and Alien Assassin, Fire Inferno's after that, and a bit of a gap back to McGillan and Cool Point. They're coming up past the stand. You can see this market raisin track is pretty tight, and they've got a complete circuit still to go, but only nine furlongs left to race. They're past the winning post then there, and they swing out for their final circuit of the track with expensive Nala, just a little more than two lengths in the lead now from Mandrake Root in second and the Grey Alien Assassin third second Grey Duke of Finsbury is next on the outside of Snaggletooth the Grey Duke of Finsbury stable companion Fire Inferno is tucked in behind that one and Magellan and Cool Point have now joined the rest of them to make one single pack which is headed by Expensive Nala at flight number six so Expensive Nala then just pulling away again now by three as they come into number seven which comes up very quickly after six Alien Assassin's moved into second Mandrake Root still there in third Snaggletooth moved off the fence in fourth Magellan is cutting through the pack ominously into fifth place but it's Expensive Nala in the lead by about a length and a half to Alien Assassin on the outside over to third last they go mistake by Mandrake Root that could have cost that one any chance it's got it Expensive Nala is still the leader from Alien Assassin second. Snaggletooth Magellan coming round the outside. Mandrake Root trying to recover from that mistake. Fire Inferno, Duke of Finsbury, and then Cold Point. They're all still in this, and they've only got two more flights to take and three and a half furlongs to go. And suddenly Magellan has swept through into the lead. It's Magellan who's now taken it up and has quickly got a length clear. It's Magellan in the lead. Expensive Nala's trying to fight back. Then comes Snaggletooth. Fire Inferno's trying to come round the outside. Alien Assassin and Duke of Finsbury next. Cold Point. Swinging around the outside, Mandrake Root being caught a bit flat footed over the second last they go, and Alien Assassin and Magellan having a ding dong as they race down towards the final flight. It's the grey Alien Assassin over on the far side, Magellan down on the rail, Snaggletooth back in third over the final flight they go. It's Alien Assassin from Magellan, Snaggletooth trying to close, they're inside the final furlong. It's Alien Assassin, the grey in the lead, Magellan's trying to fight back, but it's mid Alien Assassin who's hanging on, and Alien Assassin inside the final quarter furlong racing up towards the line, Alien Assassin. One last lunch from Magellan. Alien Assassin takes it. Magellan is second. Snaggle two is third. Duke of Finsbury fourth. Then called Point. Fire Inferno. Mandrake Roots. And finally, the long time leader, Expensive Nala. But it's another one for Graham Clutterbuck as he's building his bank up at the end of the season. With a good win. Magellan looked like he'd come through to steal that one, but maybe made its run just a little bit too soon. Well, Alien Assassin, the winner for Graham Clutterbuck. Magellan, second for Kevin Mina. And Snaggletooth for Joshua Sutherland, third. Duke of Finsbury was fourth for Paul Rhodes. And Cool Point for Aaron Thompson was fifth.